Hey G-Squad, welcome back to another episode of Is It Worth It? So today's episode, we have this cool, amazing product right here in my hand. And basically what this is, is a portable fan. And the cool thing about this product, if you guys look at the bottom part right here, it's basically kind of like a gorilla pot style like tripod, which is very unique. When we take a look on this side right here, you guys can see that this is basically how you guys can actually use the actual bottom part of the tripod right here. So you can basically use the tripod to grip it onto like a stroller or whatever you guys want. That's up to you guys. So for this part, it's supposed to have three different speed levels and it's supposed to be quiet, which we'll find out whether or not that's true in a second. But first thing first, let me actually open up the product to show you guys what it actually looks like and what comes out the package first. All right, so when you guys first open up, that's what it looks like inside. So this is the first thing we can see in here, which is the fan itself. On the bottom, they do provide you guys the cable, which is USB to USB-C. And they do provide you guys the instruction manual to teach you guys how to use the product and how to set it up. But now let's take a look at the actual product itself. All right, so when you guys get the product, it should look something like this. And this is what the back part looks like right there. So this part is the flexible tripod option, which is like a gorilla pod, which is very unique. And then right here, you guys can see that's where you have to plug in the cable, which is USB-C to recharge it. On the top part right here, you can see there's a button right there to activate the product. So once you guys press it one time, it will turn on. So that's speed level one, speed level two, speed level three. So as in here, it's actually really, really powerful. So definitely the first thing I just want to know about the product is the fact of the battery life on how long it lasts. So for this fan right here, it has a capacity of 2,600 mAh, which will definitely last you guys for quite some time. And then in terms of the speed level, like I mentioned, there's three different speed levels. There's speed of one, two, and three, which is low, medium, or high. And they actually mentioned about the product itself, it's supposed to be really quiet. It should be around the range of 20 to 30 dB. So let me actually test that out first to see whether or not that is true. All right, so we got it on. Let's try it out. All right, so that's speed level one, two, and three. So when it's on speed level one, it's definitely not around that 20 or 30 range that I mentioned. So if that is an issue for you guys, then it's definitely something to kind of consider. But if that's not an issue for you guys, then you guys don't have to worry about that. Honestly, I don't think that actually really matters too much as long as the product itself does work. And also in terms of the battery itself, like I mentioned, it's 2,600 mAh, which should last you guys around like 10 hours of usage maximum if you guys use it on speed level one. But obviously if you guys use it on speed level two or speed level three, you guys most likely will not get that full 10 hours that I mentioned. So next, let me actually test out the charging option to show you guys how to know when it's charging first and whether or not that actually works. So I'm gonna use the cable that they provide for us right here and we're gonna plug it into my little power bank right here. Let's test it out. So I just wanna plug this onto the back part right here. All right, so it's in. I'm not sure if you guys can see or not, but there is like a red indicator right there to show you guys when it's charging. So I believe once they fully charge, the light should turn off or change to different color like green or something. Now let me actually try to turn it on to see when it actually still works while it's being charged. So if we turn it on. All right, so it still works while it's being charged. So now let me actually try it on myself and see how well it works. So I'm gonna try speed level one first. So this one's okay. It's not like a really strong fan, so it's really, really quiet. So this is the one that will last you guys around 10 hours or so. Let me go speed level two. All right, so speed level two is definitely much stronger than speed level one. You definitely feel a lot more of that cold breeze or cold air. Let me try speed level three. All right, so speed level three is definitely much more stronger. Let me show you guys how strong it is. So I'm gonna use the bag that they provide for us right here to show you guys. This is speed level one. You guys see, it's not that strong. Speed level two. This is speed level two. Speed level three. So definitely speed level three is the strongest one, but definitely will not give you guys that full 10 hours that you guys want if you're using speed level three. But you can definitely still use the product itself while it's being charged, which is pretty cool. But definitely the coolest thing about this uh, portable fan right here is the fact that the bottom part right here, like I mentioned, it is a flexible tripod. So you can bend however you guys want in different angles. So if you guys want to open it all the way to put it down on a flat table like that, you definitely can like that. Or you can just grip it on something as well. So if you guys want to grip it onto my hand, you guys can definitely do that as well. So something like that. You can also do that like that as well. You guys can see, works really, really well. It's basically almost the same design as those flexible tripod for like a gorilla pot or whatever, which is super cool. So I definitely love how technology is slowly growing to be better and much easier and more convenient to use. And also the fact of how you guys can actually plug this anywhere as you want to to recharge it, like a power bank, wall charger, whatever, is super convenient as well. So that's basically everything that's on the product itself. Now that we do the unboxing and testing the product itself, 
now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So to me honestly, I would definitely have to say that any type of portable fan that is similar to this is definitely going to be really worth it. So especially since summer is coming up soon, it's going to get hotter, so you definitely want to cool down in some way. So whether it be getting a tower fan, a portable fan, or like an air cooler, that's up to you guys. But definitely getting any of the products I just mentioned is going to be super convenient and super useful to help you guys cool down in the hot summer days. <laughs> But then obviously for those guys who don't want or don't need one or haven't one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save the money for something else that you do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.